everyone welcome back to the special episode of billionaire's love i hope you will love it it has been seven months of the young's pregnancy help was the first thing that jungle heard when he opened the door he needed a bit of time to register where the plate was coming from but and then he noticed a hand waving from over the back of the couch in the living room jungkook held back a glance and dropped his bag near the table in the kitchen and walked over to the waving hand jungkook grabbed it and interviewed their fingers before he leaned over to the couch and smiled lovingly at his heavenly pregnant husband thang finally you are back thang huffed He tried to sit up but failed miserably. His belly is in the way and his feet are swollen. Unable to put Thang on his feet, I have been trying to get up for ages. Jungkook couldn't hold back a glance from escaping. Now his adorable husband was in his seven month and struggling to properly do things himself was becoming evident. Thang. Thang's feet has started swelling and his belly has growing bigger and bigger with each week. Jungkook adores him like this though. Even when Thang could not see it himself and had complained about feeling ugly multiple times, Jungkook has shown Thang that he is definitely wasn't through some Passionate love making. Jungkook loves seeing Thang waddle through the house. From the moment Thang has announced he was pregnant, Jungkook had loved every single moment. From the first time Thang's pants wouldn't close anymore to the twins' first kicks. Yeah, Thang is pregnant with twins. He is going to give birth to Jian altogether. He stopped laughing and help me thank slept Jungkook's arm who was goofily smiling at his husband Jungkook quickly walked to the other side of the couch on his way to help thank up he took pity when he saw the swollen feet and very agitated thank because of that instinct of me helping you up what do you think about Of a foot massage first, Jungkook offered, and with the way things had lit up, Jungkook knew he asked the right thing. Dad would be heavenly good cookie. Thang sighed and made himself comfortable on the couch again, putting his feet up. Jungkook pulled his legs on his lap as he sat down next to him. His husband Thang let out a content sigh when Jungkook started working on his feet. He closed his eyes and let Jungkook spoil him. Slowly, he felt the swelling away in his feet and legs, making him able to relax completely. With that feeling comes something else, something he has lacked. In the past week, Jungkook rubbed his feet and legs, made his blood bump faster and if especially downside then try to keep this straight in the biting down his lip when janko pressed harder onto his place feeling slightly embarrassed that this was turning thing on janko was just doing his a fever and being such a helpful husband and here he was crying making noise with every little touch i'm okay now you can stop cook thanks started when he felt himself slowly losing control his breath was labored and cry and gone was getting harder to keep in janko had a wish to what it to all seems and he was me massaging away until a high pitch struggled cry slipped out of thang's mouth and jungkook looked up to see a flusher thang what's wrong baby i just started don't you like it jungkook asked in a fake in a sense he was also started to feel needy after all those little beautiful cries that come from his husband's mouth 
um, they hung through his head back when those dead fingers travel further and further up. Feels nice. Jungkook whispered. Yes, please keep going. They hung right with her thinking that the heart of his stopping Jungkook completely thrown out of the window and they didn't even notice that Jungkook has scooted in even closer until he suddenly felt hot air blow his ear when a help escaped thang slips jungkook thang cried more jungkook whispered and kissed on his ear oh ha thang had missed this thang bite on his lips and just hoped jungkook would take the hint that thang was too embarrassed to say it loud how could they suddenly demand it when he had slapped Jungkook's hands off of him so many times in the past few weeks? Would Jungkook even want it now? After all times, Thang had rejected him. Thang was filled with insecure thoughts to even notice that Jungkook's hand had stopped and Thang was just staring at Jungkook. Thang hadn't even registered that he was whimpering. What's wrong, baby? Why are you sad? Thang opened his eyes and looked up into the worried eyes of his husband. This broke Thang suddenly. I'm so sorry. Thang's voice cracked. Halfway, stupid hormones. Why can't he just ask for it without blowing his eyes out? Thang started sniffing. Please, I know I didn't want your touch and I am sorry that I am a bloated balloon right now but I want you as soon as possible. I want to feel you deep. Can you do this? Then cried out, lips trembling and eyes watering. He grabbed Jungkook's hand and carried it over his pregnant belly. Don't worry about baby, I am not mad at you and what? My baby wants, he gets. Jungkook rolled and he started kissing on Thang's neck. And as soon their lips were together while Jungkook was ready to move down on his husband's face. After they are done, I love you, Jungkook blooded out right in that moment and blushed brushed his hand over his husband's rosy cheeks. Thang smiled and teared up until it turned into full on sobbing. I don't know why I'm crying but I love you too. He stupid hormones. Thang snippered with a water, watery smile. His big eyes looked up into Jungkook's freak. Maybe let's get you clean up before I do it again. Even your tear stern face is making me want more now. They have a smile at this and soon they were in the bathroom. Them escaped two months. Then was in hospital bed sleeping because of how exhausted he was. He did hard work more than he his capacity and his two small babies were in his right side grips while his husband Jungkook was smiling at his beautiful, small, cute family. Jungkook walked over to him. I love you, my love. Thank you for all this. The Jungkook said while kissing his husband's forehead. Three years later, Thang was washing the dishes in the sink when he heard the door open and Jungkook came in and immediately started taking off his suit in a hurry. He moves around their new house they had brought, which was particularly a mansion. Jungkook walks to the kitchen to see his husband in nothing more than a shorts and apron, giving him a perfect view of his suspicious bump. God, he wanted that man right now. 
Jungkook went to stand behind his husband as he kissed his ear, then whispered a greeting before kissing his neck and then turning him around as he kissed all over his face from his forehead to his cheeks and finally his lips as he devoured Thang like a stubborn man. Thang was enjoying the tension. This was one of their planned afternoon. Thang was ready and since they were trying for another baby they had called he had called Jungkook to come home that he was waiting Jungkook had particularly run out of the office just saying family emergency as an excuse of course Namjoon and Jin knew they were trying for another baby Jungkook picked up their twins sons Thaguk and Gookie from school since it was time anyways dropped them with their grandparents who would send them home later in the evening. Thayong had graduated university with first class and now owned his own hospital that specialist in cancer treatment. His sons Thaguk and Guki were three years old and since everything was stable they decided they wanted another kid. Jungkook picked the hung off the ground as the man wrapped his hands around his neck. Jungkook walked wasted no time in placing the on the top of the dining table and continued kissing him before finally showing the baby making process with the with the with his back on the table as they cried out in pain and happiness with each deep and passionate kiss and act as Jungkook was granted in feeling. Thank God the house helps were given leave or else they would have heard his husband's scream of the pain and feelings. They went at it freaking like rabbits from dining room to two rooms to other rooms before their bedroom until they were both exhausted. By the time the driver came home with the boys, Tim was so tired he was still asleep. Two weeks later, Jungkook got a visit from Thayong in office. They went to lunch where his impress gave him the good news. Thayong told Jungkook that he, he was pregnant and they were so happy. I love you baby so much. Now I want a baby girl as we already have two words. Boys, Jungkook said and they slapped him on his shoulder. My kids are not bots. It's you who is spoiling them a lot. Now stop complaining and I would love a baby girl too, they said while blessing. Nine months later, they welcomed their daughter Jian Thegi into the world. Another bottle of joy added to their lives. It was all they needed. A happy family of three kids and parents. The end. Tell me how was the special episode. Don't forget to tell me in the comment section as you all want a special episode for Mute's Love also. So I will try to write it and I'll see you another maybe one short episode. Till then take care of yourself. Bye bye.